Now, just when you guys thought things couldn't get any crazier up until what you guys have seen thus far, then boy, oh boy, do I have a lot to say here today. As I do want to go on ahead now and welcome you all back once again to another Gaming Roulette special, Halloween edition number three. And let me tell you, we're going to be playing a whole lot of scary games and going a little bit in depth with what I have coming on the channel very, very soon. And not for nothing, being the fact that it is Halloween season, I love scary movies, I love playing scary games, and I think the Dark Masters manga is going to take a much darker turn than how a lot of you guys think it is. In which to that, you guys can go on ahead and find each of the games that we're gonna be playing located down in the description box below. Because not only are we gonna be jumping into some scary games, but we're also gonna be talking about some very interesting things coming up. So with that being said, let's go on ahead and begin. Okay, so first things first, in case some of you guys were wondering if any of the Dark Masters were going to have any sort of interaction with any outside universes from Universe 7, then the quick and easy simple answer to that is going to be yes, and this fight in and of itself involving the Dark Master Gira and Kale along with several other characters is definitely going to be something that I believe a lot of you guys are going to enjoy, especially after having to see the female-to-female -female interaction. But not only that, Dark Master Gira is in fact actually in charge for a huge scientific portion of the Demon Realm down below and for a lot of what you guys are going to see in terms of demons having to collect blood samples or anything of the sorts to kind of go as far as to replicate the original or even go as far as to create clones i think you guys are really going to enjoy gira's interaction once she ends up inevitably meeting kale and Khalifa and eventually enough kefla as well but what i will say moving forward are the dark masters are going to be getting a significant amp once specific things certain things end up falling in place and so they're not going to be the only ones getting a huge huge buff in this story. Of course, Kale's gonna be getting a huge buff, Kaba's gonna be getting a huge buff, Caulifla's gonna be getting a huge buff, and I'm actually going to go as far as to introduce something very, very different involving those three specifically, even when it comes down to the girls themselves, because what I essentially plan on doing is giving you guys something that I don't think you guys have ever seen before involving Kale and Caulifla, and so if you aren't already a part of the Patreon team, then you guys are definitely missing out on so much content, including early action access to videos, soundtracks, PNGs, and so much more, and also even going as far as to miss out on early access to some of the exclusives that I have coming up in the next few weeks, and so with that being said now, let's go on ahead and jump into the next fight that we have coming up ahead, because let me tell you, this is going to be something very, very important that I think you guys might want to stick around and pay very close attention to. So check this out, something very big is about to happen to Raijin's character that's going to shift the entirety of the story as we know it, and just in case by some mere coincidence if you thought that I forgot about the character of Frieza, I actually didn't because something very big is going to happen involving Frieza's character and of course Raijin as a whole as the story ends up continuing, because as we already know, Frieza isn't really a good guy, he doesn't really like to side with the bad guys either, but something very big is going to happen to Frieza his character once certain things end up falling in place here and at first when you guys end up seeing what's about to take place some of you guys might actually think that oh freeze is up to no good again but then again he actually may not be as bad as you think or is he you know what i mean so freeze is gonna be shifting and kind of moving around from kind of appearing as though he's on the good guy squad but maybe he's on the bad guy squad but maybe really he isn't maybe he doesn't want to choose a side you know what i mean and yes just think case if you guys are curious frieza will be retaining his black form in this story and he will also be getting something very very different something very exclusive only to him that i think a lot of you guys are going to be saying oh my god by the end of it especially with what you end up seeing once the story continues so it's like i said before you do not want to miss out on being a part of the patreon squad to see everything first before anybody else including frieza's new transformation and so much more to which again patreon.com slash unreal and gaming to which i will go ahead and leave that link located down in the description box below and pinned comment section below as well because I think that's as far as I want to go with Frieza's character and kind of keeping him a little bit of a mystery by comparison to everyone else because it's not like Frieza has any sole intention on keeping Goku or Vegeta around for his own personal pleasure but at the same time let's not forget that at his core Frieza is an absolutely evil entity and would even go as far as to do literally anything and everything that he possibly could in becoming number one in ruling 
over everyone and everything so i think with what you guys are going to see take place as the story continues you guys are definitely going to enjoy it so no i did not forget about frieza frieza is definitely in the story as well as frost and so many other characters like hit as well because it was like i said a year and a half ago this sequel story is going to be a very very long one and so with that being said let's now go in ahead and jump into the next game that we have lined up because if you thought that we were finished oh no 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 we have so much more to talk about Okay, so I know that it's been a long time since we went back to do this, but welcome back to Ultimate Battle Simulator 2 and check this out. 1 million zombies versus 10,000 modern soldiers. I'm going to be honest with you guys, I'm so hyped that my PC can actually hold this because look, we have an entire base, we have 10,000 soldiers literally armed to the T, and then on the other side, we have literally an armada of zombies just waiting to dig in. And I want to go on ahead now and see if my soldiers can actually get the job done. Of course, I have a total of 10 tanks. So hopefully I think that the tanks should do a relatively good job in holding a lot of these zombies back. So I wanted to go on ahead now and kind of see how this is going to go. So without wasting any more time, here we go. Oh my God. All right. So the zombies are Jesus Christ. Okay. So the zombies are attacking, and I think my soldiers are clearing a lot of them out relatively quickly, so... Damn! Easily, I will say, probably a few thousand of them had to have gone down, like, immediately, because the bloodshed right now that's spilling throughout the battlefield is uncanny, and it's not coming from the modern soldiers. Damn! They're flanking them! Oh, boy. Oh, boy, this ain't good. See, I could easily go on ahead now and jump in this, but... Holy God! Talk about a bloodbath during the season of Halloween, right? And I swear to you, I think that this is what World War Z should have been like. I feel as though this is what Resident Evil, all of the live action movies should have been like. You know what I mean? But for whatever reason, we don't get movies like this. We have games that are simulating this. And so I wanna, I wanna see real quick. Hold on, this is nuts. And you know what? I think that the soldiers might come close, but I gotta give it to the zombies. Look at this! Look at this! Yo! Alright, my soldiers are, uh... They're holding the front line. I mean, the tanks are still holding the front line, too, so that's good. But the last time I did this, I kid you guys not, the zombies, over time, were able to just immediately outnumber me and just slaughter every single person. And look at all of the bodies! beginning to stack up out here dude it's like ants it's like witnessing a whole bunch of ants just run in and, and just only for them to get gunned down but the question here is will the soldiers on the outside be able to hold out long enough for the soldiers on the inside to get rid of them because i'm not too sure look at this look at this wall of yo this wall of humanity bro what, what is this imagine being caught in a situation where you're literally participating, like, just you're a part of this. Oh, they, oh, they broke through. Oh, they broke through. They fell. Oh, look at this. And I mean, the way they're moving, they kind of remind me of, like, the train to Busan zombies, the 28 days later zombies, you know what I mean? Oh, the soldiers are gunning them down. I, I mean, we're squatted up on the rooftops. We got everybody just lined up real quick. So I'm not too sure, man. I think the zombies might do it because... There's 1 million zombies and approximately 10,000 soldiers, right? Oh, talk about holding the front line, dude. Holy Jesus. And the bodies just keep piling up. So I think that it's because of the zombies flanking that it might cause us to be in a bit of trouble. Because look at this. They're flanking on the other side. They're trying to... Oh, they're in. They're in. Oh, they're in. Holy crap, they're in. Here we go. Oh my goodness. Okay, so they were able to barge in. With all of the soldiers holding them off on the outside, they have officially now started to enter through the front gate. Oh my, look at these soldiers. These soldiers are as good as dead. Oh my god. Look at this. Imagine being a part of something like this. If this isn't terrifying, 
especially being a soldier, to witness one million infected zombies just charging right towards your direction. I mean, if that isn't terrifying enough, I don't know what is, but I mean, my soldiers are trying to hold the front line. They're trying to get it in. There's blood everywhere. And so let me know down below as to who you guys believe is going to come out of this victorious because this is a little similar to what I'm going to be doing within the Dark Master story without giving too much away. So you can kind of ultimately expect something similar to this. But look at the soldiers, man. Like, I don't think that you would pay me enough to do this. Because you have to imagine, like, if you're dealing with zombies like this, even if there's 10,000 of you, there's no way that you'll be able to handle, I think, a million zombies. You know what I mean? Like, you have to have the, just the best kind of, like, weaponry. You have to have, like, several tanks. The tanks are trying to do what they can, and they're blasting zombies away, but this is just insane. And now... They're starting to flank the soldiers. This is bad. Oh my goodness, bro. Oh, they, they literally... Okay, so the soldiers from the front lines are, like, diminishing. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The soldiers that were all on the front lines now are now beginning to diminish. What is... Th th this game is so insane. Like, what? what is this? This is chaos. There's literally blood, guts, gore... There are bodies just lying everywhere. They're, they they literally look like ants. Like a whole bunch of fire ants just like trying to rush on in to like claim their prey. I don't know about this one. I mean, someone recommended this to me and said, hey, how about you go back and play Ultimate Battle Simulator? And here we are. Look at these zombies, man. Look at how many of them there are, bro. You got to be insane. You have to at least give me... Like, the best body armor, the best weaponry. Look at this. And they're all headed in one direction. And that's to feast on the soldiers. Oh, my God. I don't know about this. Look, just look at the front. Look at the front. So, the bodies are beginning to pile up like no tomorrow. So, while everyone is beginning to, like, just pile up, like, I guess the entrance ways are going to get stuffed. Because, like, there are, there are bodies coming in from, like, all four, like, all directions. Yo! Place your bets right now before this portion of the video ends. If you guys are for Team Soldiers or Team Zombies, let me know down below. Because, yo, the soldiers look like they're doing pretty good. The soldiers don't look like they're about to, like, falter in this because... They're literally just, like, slamming into these dudes with, like, repeated amounts of bullets, but... Damn, they... So, so, all of the soldiers on the outside have been destroyed. Yo, they literally ran through all of the soldiers on the outside, bro. Holy... Yo, the humanity. Yo, the humanity! And everyone is firing upon, like, every direction... There is, there is no stopping. Like, you got soldiers on the rooftops. You got soldiers, like, in the trenches. Look how terrifying this is. And I think the most terrifying part is, like, if you run out of bullets. You know what I mean? Look at this. How many tanks? We still got a few tanks. They're, they're actually piling up over the wall. So we went from five tanks on this side to three. Yo, this is crazy. This is legit insane. Hold the line, man! You guys can expect something just like this in the Dark Master story. To which, without giving too much away, there's going to be, like, an absolute bloodbath that happens in the Demon Realm when Goku and Vegeta and everybody else ends up going down there. So, I'm not going to say too much as to who ends up going down there, but it's just going to be an absolute bloodbath. So, you can only imagine as to what that's going to be like. And, I mean, honestly... Like, you can thank games like this for, like, being the direct inspiration behind that. Look at this, and they're piling up. They just keep piling up. Like, no matter how many bodies are laid out, they're actually using that as a means to get over the wall and infiltrate the base, which is insane. And I can't even imagine, like, what that would be like as a soldier to see something like this, but I honestly wish that we had a movie that captured something like this because we don't get too much of content like this like you know what i'm saying 
Like, I think that if we saw something like this in any film, it would be insane. We've seen, I guess, like, watered-down versions of instances like this, but never, you know, never to this extent, never to this kind of a scale. Look at the zombies, bro. They're actually trying to flank and get in through the other side. That is so smart. Look at them. They're like a whole bunch of ants, so, like, they're not only are they trying to flank, but they're closing in from the right side, from the left side, from the north, from the south. So I'm not too sure. I think I think the sides are are gonna be what's gonna do it in. Because look at this. They've already infiltrated the side area. And I mean, even though they're piling up right now, they are just swarming in from two different directions on over from the side. Three actually. They're going, they're coming over through the wall and they're entering through two different points. Whereas over here, they seem like they're trying to get in through like the front, but the front is crazy because they're about to literally hop over the wall. Dude, look at this. All of the soldiers are gone. All of the tanks are gone. Are you kidding me? Look how many, look how many zombies there are, dude. Look how many zombies there are. And, and this is just like, Look at this, this is just the tip of the iceberg. Look how many of them there are, dude. And my soldiers are supposed to obliterate all of them. Look at this. If this doesn't tell you something, then I don't know what does because there are so many of them. And, they, and the fact that they cleared out 10 tanks, I believe they cleared out about maybe a couple of thousand soldiers on the outside. So now, look at this, they're flooding through the inside, dude! This is nuts! This... This is literally, like, the pinnacle of not just survival, or at least, like, fighting for your own survival, but just seeing all of these soldiers, like, go in. I, I, like, I'm so tempted to get in there and play as one, because I can. But I, I, I honestly do not see myself getting far because look at... Just look at this. And the more they keep piling in, there is no way that the soldiers are going to be able to outlast them. Like, hands down. So... But I mean, thus far, I think that what? We're close to about 12 minutes into this. So for 12 minutes, I'm only going to assume that we've killed maybe a couple of tens of thousands of zombies, maybe a hundred thousand, two hundred thousand, give or take three hundred thousand zombies have died. You know, three hundred thousand being max. But at this raid, I definitely see the soldiers going down first because look at, look at the way they're charging over the barrier and they're dogpiling on top of the other bodies to get to the soldiers, dude. Like, this is crazy. Yo! Nah, if I was a soldier, I would I would definitely request immediate backup. Either immediate backup and reinforcements, or we gotta get the hell up out of here. Like, we need an extraction point ASAP. We need a helicopter, we need napalm strikes, we need something, dude. Look at the humanity. Like, seriously, like, all that that's all you see is blood and body parts all over the place. So let me know down below as to what you guys would do in a situation like this, because look this sea of infected so you have blood all over the place you have so many bodies just being mowed down from all of the gunshots that they're literally climbing over other you know dead people's corpses just to get to the living like does that make sense we have the entire floor covered here watch this watch this oh we're playing as a soldier yo look at the, how cool is this man all right we gotta we gotta get rid of some of these zombies man Oh my, I wouldn't even know what to do. Hold on. Let me, uh, let me see. I, I, I'm actually too scared to, like, progress any further, but let me see. Damn it, now! Oh, don't, 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 don't. Yo, this is too much. This is, I mean, oh, the carnage. Nah, you know what? I'm gonna swap out. Hold on. I wanna see if I can swap out for one of these soldiers. Look at the view. Oh, crap. Look at the view, though. Like, this is insane. Let me, let me try. Let me try drawing their attention. Oh, that, that, that's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. Oh, that's bad. Hold on. I shouldn't. Oh, they, damn. These, these guns. 
These burst rat like these burst guns are like not good at all, man. This is bad. This is bad. Damn it. I died. Wait, I'm alive. Okay, hold on. So wait, are they using like burst rounds? Like I I'm just I'm just trying to understand that. Oh, I'm out of here. Nah, I'm out of here, boss. I do not want to get caught in the middle of this. There. Damn. Yo, you can't even you can't even run away even if you tried. That's how crazy this is. You can't even run away if you tried. Look at this. They're actually dogpiling over the wall. These things are climbing over the entire wall. Just let that sink in, man. Let that sink in. Let me know down below if there's any, I guess, Halloween movie that I could watch you know this month that would represent something like this because i want to watch a zombie film where it's something like this that there's something similar to this but we don't have like anything close to this maybe outside of world war z like does that make sense so that's why this becomes like so difficult to like process because if we had a zombie film that had something like this then that would be insane let me see if i can uh hold on Damn, bro, there's so many of them. I don't I don't even know. I don't, like I I just don't know how to process this. There's because the, there's so many of them. Why are there so many of them? And how come like we haven't eliminated at least half of them? We have enough bullets to take them down, right? We have enough manpower, but like they just won't die. And they're so durable too. So it's like no matter what it is that I try to do, I can't do anything. And look at the sea of zombies, bro. Oh, God. You know what? Now I'm fighting in the middle. Of okay. All right. So I lasted like literally 2.3 seconds in there. That, that was that was, that was was terrible. Oh, these poor soldiers, bro. There's blood everywhere. All right, men. Draw forces. Distract them. Come on. Oh, damn it. I can't even like distract them because like they attack me all at the same time. And then they, they just carry on after that. But, I mean, it's gotten to the point where there are so many bodies that are piling up that they're literally climbing over the bodies. And they have already infiltrated the area. Look at this. You guys have seen, like, the, like the beginning of this. It was just a wall with people. And now it's a wall of corpses. What the hell? Nah, man. I don't... I don't see these soldiers making it out of this. I'm sorry. Like, these soldiers are going to go down. They're going to go down. Look at this. They've already infiltrated the sides. So it's only a matter of time before, I think, they take down all of these soldiers that are guarding, like, the side entrances. And then from there, they'll just be able to, like, hit the other remaining soldiers from all sides. And then that's it. Look at these. Look at these two. These two are the only... Okay, never mind. I was about to say... I kind of spoke a little too early. This guy's the only guy left. And you know what? Let me see something real quick. Is he going to survive this? I'm not... I'm not too sure. They don't see him. They don't see him. I think he's the only soldier that maybe has a cure. This is the soldier that is basically immune. So he's the only one holding by. Watch this. Let me see something. Hey! Wait, can they see me? Oh, wait. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, they can. Oh, yeah, they can. Never mind. Wow! Dude, they mauled that guy. Yeah, here they come. Oh, here they come. See, I'm curious if they'll be able to get to the rooftops, but I think that they can because of the overwhelming amount of bodies that they could just end up climbing over and just getting on top of. You know what I mean? Oh, this is bad. Yeah, what did I just say? What did I just say? Once they flank all of these soldiers, it's done. Oh my God, there they go. Now, nah, this is the part where we request for an immediate evacuation. Oh, hell no, dude. And these zombies are all just like standing there just waiting. Look at this. There's no way. There's no way that these soldiers are going to be able to make it out of this alive. Hell no. Like, seriously, unless maybe one of them ends up acquiring a rocket launcher for everybody, then sure. But all of these soldiers are like super tactical proof. They have assault rifles and everything. But let me see. Hold on. Let me see if I can. I can't even see anything, dude. Like the humanity. Damn you, Dark Masters. Hold on. Let me see if I can. I can't do anything, dude. I can't. Like we're hitting them. 
but it's not yeah it's not even doing anything there are so many zombies and these are like some durable zombies too so it's not like they aren't going down because they are but these zombies can take a hit look at this so not only did they flank and work all of the soldiers on the outside but now the soldiers on the inside are basically barricaded in so unless you're one of the soldiers on the roof there is no way you're gonna survive this look at these look at these look at these two soldiers down here dude oh hold on let me see is he gonna go down is he gonna go down let's see oh he went down dude all right they're gonna they're definitely gonna get these four but uh this is crazy man let me know down below if we should do more of this because I definitely want to. This is just... Look at this. They've, they've piled up so much that they've slaughtered every single soldier. Look at this. They're on the roof. Look at this. You guys have seen the beginning of this. They have piled up on here like bees. Like bees on honey, dude. Look at this. There's only like... I don't even know how many soldiers there are, but the ones on the ground are finished. The only ones that might, and I mean might end up surviving this, are the ones on the roof, but yeah, this is the only squadron left on the ground. That's crazy, dude. And there's like, what is it, like three more guys over there. Look at that. They're, yo, they're piling up so much that they're almost as big as one of these like rooftops dude they're, they're about to literally climb and like just lunge over the roof and these four quacks let me see is there any way that i can shoot these things oh come on come on get rid of them we can't do much man let me see if i can uh climb over oh this is all so oh oh boy that's not good that's not good that's not good that's not all oh, they're gonna eat me they're gonna eat oh, i'm dead dude you can't do anything like you can't like we i can't escape hold on what is this oh I'm, I'm glitched no the one soldier who's glitched underneath the corpses bro oh yeah he's dead he's dead he's dead there's no way yeah i'm dead there's no way this is crazy bro like i'm just trying to get a scope of this so i can't like there's no exit because if you try to exit the zombies are just gonna swarm you so like there's no means of escape and if you remain on the rooftop it looks like they're going to get to you because look at where they currently are right now dude they're literally like climbing over all of the other you know just dead infected just to get to the survivors and they're just swarming look at that they're uh, they're, uh, they're approaching in the opposite direction the only ones left are the soldiers on the roof that's it straight up oh no why wait wait oh why did i fall down oh that's that's not good oh wait he's still holding his own he's still holding his own hold on i don't know hold on let me uh there's literally nothing that we can do i don't have i don't have any weapon that's strong enough to maybe take these things down dude let me know if you guys want to see like i guess another part to this because i think it's safe to say that oh god yeah, I think it's safe to say that the modern soldiers are about to get eviscerated. Like, there's just no hope for them at all. Like, at all. Because look at outside the wall. There are still, like, hundreds of thousands of them just waiting. That's crazy, dude. Like, even if I had a sniper, even if I had a shotgun, like, I don't think there's any situation that I can end up finding myself in that would inevitably cause me to overcome this because look at this they're literally climbing over each other to get to the modern soldiers bro nah this is crazy i have never seen anything like this that's why i love playing this is because you can simulate some crazy ass stuff nah the soldiers are done the soldiers are done there's no way there's no way. There's no way that these soldiers are going to be able to pull out of this unless they napalm strike the entire area or just nuke everything, which would be amazing if they had, you know, the option to do so. But like, I don't know, like this is this is you only have like 
a few dozen soldiers remaining and that's it so i think i think we can call oh, damn oh you saw that so i'm dropping them down so that they can fight on on the ground here but they just got mauled dude like that's sad all right let me uh let me see how far we can go because i think we can all agree that the soldiers have no chance like these soldiers have no chance because it's only going to be a matter of time before not only the zombies like overwhelm the soldiers and, and i'm stuck wonderful but the moment these zombies are able to like infiltrate and climb over on the rooftops and then just bounce from location to location then this is pretty much it look at this they're swarming all of my guys dude all these poor soldiers next time i think um uh, i'm definitely gonna add like more soldiers because a situation like this is just like extreme it's extreme for like the worst cases because like my soldiers i'm trying to see if i can get out of here oh yeah that 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 didn't work out for me so yeah look at this look at this they're already on the roof it's done these guys are finished yeah there's there's no chance in hell there's no chance in hell with that so i guess with all that being said because i think we can all kind of already see that these these humans are basically finished let's now go on ahead and jump into the next game to see what we got coming up next because let me tell you it's bound to be just as crazy as this because this is just ridiculous man it's over gg guys gg Okay, so you knew we had to come back to this one. Welcome to the Resident Evil 4 Remake. We just ended up taking down Ramon Salazar's right-hand goon. And so now... Me to put my faith in someone who used to work for Umbrella. Of course. So you heard, huh? And that's done for. Well, even though yeah, Umbrella's done for, me and Luis now... You didn't answer my question. ...have to make our way... What are you after? ...towards the tunnels. I just want to feel good about myself. You hear this guy? something like that okay well i'm not gonna buy into the idea of mr luis just doing this out of the sake of his heart you know just to kind of make amends because he feels guilty after working for umbrella but uh oh damn bats here y'all have to go back and play this game especially during the season of halloween very good game very creepy game i've seen a lot of people talk about how the score could have been better and i agree oh i remember this Oh, this is going to suck because I think we're going to be fighting a whole bunch of ganados on the right-hand side of the tunnel here. Yeah, I need to put TNT here, right? Yeah, I don't have any, uh... Since when was this a dead end? Well, I don't know. This used to lead to the exit. Well, I mean, you're supposed to be the one to guide me out of here, right? But I guess not. What is this? M4. All right, well, I believe that this is going to be the section where we need to collect the dynamite sticks. And so y'all already know me, right? I'm not really a stealthy kind of person, so... Looks like we've got company. Yeah, we do. What do you want to do? Oh, we're going to go in there guns ablaze and watch this. Let me see. Who am I going to go after? Uh... Okay, I can't... I can't really climb up there, right? No. All right. Well, follow me. We're doing this. Ayesta! Matalo! We're going to go in ahead and take all of these goons out. Let me go in ahead and just... Bam! That right there! All right, at least we took one guy down. So, again, I'm, I may have made reference so many times over. You guys can go back to this game and just see how many of the elements... Oh, boy. How many of the elements I was inspired by to create, you know, a lot of my demons in uh, the Murno sequel. Stay down, damn it. Stay down. Is he down? Yes. Okay. Damn it. That's the most annoying part. Oh, God. They're throwing dynamite at me. Damn it. All right, go down. Luis, help. Help me out, man. Okay. Yo, can y'all... Oh, damn it. Can y'all not? Oh, God. Oh, no. He got the dynamite stick right there. No, Luis. Get him off me. Run, run, run. He, oh, we're, we're going to die. Oh. What the hell is happening? Luis. Oh, Jesus. Man, what a way to... What a way to go about the gaming roulette special and then by just blowing up a bunch of ganados via their own dynamite sticks, huh? Alright, let me, uh... 
Let me make sure that everything is peaches and cream here. I need to lower that bridge there. Okay, uh, I think it's on the other side, right? Yeah, it's over there. Oh, hello. What up, guys? All right, thank you so much for... Oh, Grandma's still here, damn it. Grandma's still out. Grandma's still engaging. Hold on, let's go ahead and just run right past them. Damn. Look at Grandma there with the dynamite stick. You think, you think I'm not going to take you down? Watch this. Oh, she still has it, right? There we go. Oh, this is crazy. What? Oh, let me get, let me get some ammo. Hold on. G give me some ammo, Lee. Give me some ammo. How thoughtful. You know, I wish till this day, and I've said this so many times before, I, I cannot stress it enough. I wish that they made a cohesive, consistent lineup of live action Resident Evil films that followed the games like to the T nothing that's like low budget nothing that's like just half shitty you know what I mean I'm always gonna have an opinion on that cuz I, I just think it's BS I, I, I swear to god I do all right let me uh let me get the hell up out of here cuz it, it really sucks when like the live action films are garbage but the animated films are really fun you know what I mean you better you better back up grandpa Oh, you better back up. Oh. All right, little, yo, Luis, I need you to... Unless you want to take them all out first, but... I need you to come up here with me so we can get the hell up out of here. So we can grab... Oh, hello. Damn, did you see the way they ran out? Uh-oh. Damn it. Damn it. Get out of my face. Sorry. Must have slipped. Yeah, must have... Oh, yeah, no, no. I'm not, I'm not going to let him transform. All right. So we need to, oh, oh no, you better get your nasty shit rubbing hands off of me. Yeet. Oh, I missed, damn it. All right. Uh-oh. I hate this so much. Because, like, these parasites are, like, they're so freaking annoying. Let me go on ahead now and uh, just grab everything that I can before they start, like, jumping me up in here, because that'll really suck if they do. Which is something I don't want them to do, actually. So let me see what I got going on right here. Okay, so I don't know what happened. My screen just went black. And so I had to restart everything. I have my dynamite sticks here. So let's go on ahead and blow this thing to kingdom come. I guess I guess the Resident Evil gods did not want me to progress here. Uh oh, watch this, watch this. Oh, that's right. Oh, damn. You know, when I first played this game... I just like stood there and I had those rocks well. just crush me. You sure you're just a researcher? Yeah, right? I'm just an average guy who uh -huh. happens to be quite the ladies man. Quite the ladies man, yeah? But Jack Jack Krauser ends up killing you later. Right? Which was really sad, especially his last line, people change, right? <laughs> like damn, that was really sad. Like I I I feel as though Luis should have been giving a uh, he should have been given a little more. But I don't know. Oh, I remember this. Uh-oh. It's Ganado's time. The giant Ganado's. The, oh, was it El Gigante? Right? Uh-oh. Yeah, okay. Well, that's the way how we... After you, I insist. Okay. Gentlemen. Oh! Oh, shit! Oh, that would have been it. What do you think is going to happen, Luis? Come on. Oh, yeah. Really? Get off me, you giant... Piece of crap! Help! Now you owe me. Yeah, right. Oh yeah, there's two of them. Oh my god! How did that? How did that steel thing didn't break? Oh no! Oh no! Oh, there's two of them! Oh yeah, you don't say. All right, I'm gonna take him out. I need to go on ahead and just take him out. I'm I'm, I'm just gonna keep shooting him in the face, dude. Oh, back up, back up, back up, you son of a... Ah! Uh, I know that I'm gonna have to open up the center and just drop them, but maybe I can take out the one without the armor without having to drop him. Oh, I need to, I need to make sure that I have... Oh, no. Um, okay. Let me... Let me combine that, use that. Let me go on ahead and just equip that. All right, stand clear! Oh, you know what? Yeah. 
Listen, whatever happens, happens. I'm just gonna start throwing grenades, man. I'm just gonna start throwing grenades. Listen, I think Luis is like immortal when it comes down to being like my AI partner, so I don't think he'll he'll die necessarily, but Oh god. Alright, throw that grenade. What else do we have here? Alright. Stay right there. Hold on, I got you. You damn parasite worm. Oh come on, Leon. Come on. If I end up dying, that'll suck. I need to do something. What do I have? Uh, hold on. Alright, I don't know necessarily how to go about this. Maybe I should drop them, but I don't... To get, Oh, God, to get them in the center is annoying. But I'll, I'm gonna try anyway. Get out of the way, Luis! Alright, let's see. Yeah, that, that, that did nothing. Oh, that was such garbage. Oh, God. Oh, God, they're right there. Hold on. Let me see. What can I... What do I have here? I don't have anything. I got a grenade, but hold on. All right, you bastards. I'm just going ahead and throw this right over there. Okay. Okay, stay. Are, are they stunned? Are they stunned? Okay, stay right there. Oh, no, he moved. Louise, bring him here. Bring him here. Oh, you know what? Damn it. Why doesn't he just go down? Oh, he's after me. Oh, God. You take him down first. Oh, Wait, what just happened? Oh, we got him. Oh, we got him. Yeah, down goes, down goes ugly face. Yo, okay, this one's going to be annoying. Yeah, this one's going to be annoying. We're going to have to drop him. Oh, we're going to have to drop him into the lava. What do you mean? Yo, yo, yo. Nah, dude, I know he's not leaving me. Help me out. Is he going to, is he going to put the dynamite on his back? Oh, 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 oh. Luis, I need you. Where is he? Where'd he go, dude? My, oh, there he is. My dude! Over here! All right, I, I need to lure, I need to lure him over here. Hold on. You stay right there, you. All right. Strap it, strap it, strap it. There we go. All right, put it on him, put it on him. Delivery! All right, yo, this is it. This is it, this is it. Oh, Blow, blow this dude to king. Oh, hi, 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 come on. I'm trying. Shut up. This is horrifying. Then again, I don't know how they would do this in a live action film, but I mean, obviously CGI. Where is he at? There it is. Got it. All right. Let me just drop him. Let me just drop him, please. I'm trying. Hold on. Let me. Oh, God. Stay right there. 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 Yes. Oh, we cooking. Oh, we cooking, cooking, huh? Yeah, into the fire. Yeah, into the fire. That's right. Burn. Jesus, man. Yo, that was nuts. The hell? God, look at this. Oh yeah. I think we can get through here. Ya tu sabes, so then go through, bro. I What do you want me to do? Yo, that was an experience. And just going back to relive that is always fun. Because, like, these things are, like, I mean, fighting them two on, How's well, two on two, essentially, is fun. Is he gonna open it or what? Yo! Open the door. There. It's open. Is it? Is it now? Alright, let's see. Again, I feel so bad for this dude, man. Like, Louise should have survived. I don't know. I mean... Well, that was a pain. Well, sure was. They're keeping those things cooped up down here, too. The underground here is sacred to them. Of course. See, this is where they discovered Las Plagas. Ah. Served inside ancient deposits of Ember. Ah. Of course they did. That's crazy. Like, the Las Plagas virus, or like the parasites, were discovered in Amber down here. So once these goons found it, they were just like, oh yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna worship this. We're gonna use this against people. Like, you know what I mean? Hey, look, don't be surprised if like IRL... Things like this are actually, you know, real. Per se. Suggesting we ride this thing. Oh yeah, yeah, we are. Any other way? Well, I guess we have no other choice here, but let me go on ahead and save just in case because I don't want to die in the process of this. Okay, so it looks like we have no other choice but to get this going, so let's go on ahead and just push. This should speed things up a bit. Oh, this is gonna I suck. Doing this. Hey, we're in a hurry, right? Well, yeah. By the way, yeah. What now? 
You like thrill rides? No! No! Oh god. Okay, so I gotta I gotta watch my corners. I'm gonna have to watch everything right now because Yeah, I, I understand that, Luis. Help me out here, please. Oh this oh this sucks, this sucks, this sucks. Not only do I have to Okay, hold on, just damn it. Where oh no no no, hold on. Oh god. Alright, where where are the Ganados? Oh this sucks, dude. Oh this really sucks, man. Um palastello, you hear them too. Yeah, I understand that. I I need you to like relax. There they are. Oh god. Oh they got they got freaking bows and arrows and everything. Damn it, crossbows. I got Get out of here, you! I got infinite ammo, so that's that's what matters. Also, I believe the uh the chainsaw dude is here too. Back up. Back up. I'm try Oh! Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't see that. I did not see that. Stay on track, stay on track, stay on track. Damn it. No, it's not, Luis. I need you to just hold on for dear life. No! Oh, this is this is awful. Here they come. Oh god, here they come! Oh, oh I should have shot. Ah, damn it. Okay, so the pressure. The pressure is definitely on. Okay. That did nothing. Yeah, they're on me, dude. They're on me. Shut up. Oh, dynamite boy. Nope, no, 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 no. We ain't trying to get blown up here. I can't. Yo, the thing is, too, I can't imagine playing this, like, unprofessional. Like, I tried, and that shit is hard as hell. Because, like, a few hits, and you're done. Like, you know what I mean? Oh, this is wild. Um... Yo, I need you to, uh, Luis, I need you to also maybe help me shoot. I think that would be very important. No? Oh, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Slow down, slow down. Slow down, and we're good. Are we? That's it. Well, partially. Things are just getting started. Oh, no, dude. Yeah, I remember this. All right, so where are they at? Because I, I, I know they're around here. And I'm not trying to... I'm not trying to engage with any chainsaw-wielding maniacs here, which I don't think they're going to be around, but... Oh, hello. Hola, amigo. Watch this. Oh, wait, hold on. I was going to kick him, but... I hear dynamites, bro. Damn it. They got dynamites. Yeah, they're throwing dynamites. They're trying to ensure that I die. That I just stay dead. You know what I mean? Uh-oh. Back up, you. Shut up. Now, we're definitely going to be coming back to this because... This is... Not only is this, like, insane on so many levels. Only because, like, this is... This is for us to move ever so closer towards, like, finishing things up here. But everything... Just everything about this is just so good. <laughs> Okay, so I may not know where I am yet, but what I do know is that chaos is about to ensue. Welcome back to the Callisto Protocol. And so I guess right now the best thing that we can do is find our way out of here because as bloody as this place is, which there's a lot of, I don't think that I should dwell down here longer than I should because... Oh, hell no. Did you guys just hear that, man? Just imagine, you're a prisoner on this unknown planet, right? Where they're keeping everybody hostage at, right? And so, like, all hell just ends up breaking loose after you end up freeing yourself and you look upon, like, you know, the scenery and you just see everyone getting eaten alive, right? What the hell is that sound? Oh, nah, bro. There's something over there. Yo, y'all hear that? Oh! Oh, hell no. What are you, crazy? Who's there? Raijin? You're bugging. You're insane if you think that I'd be out here by myself doing this. Like, look at all this. What is this? It's like alien come all over the walls. Like, why? Oh, I don't know about this, chief. 
There's a blood trail here. I don't know. Oh, it's dark as balls here. All right. Well, let me uh, grab this. I think I remember what I need to do. But this really sucks. I mean... You don't even have any protection. Like, you know what I mean? Like, you're just out here in the middle of nowhere. Just expected to run roughshod and just run through everything when in actuality you can't because it's like what protection do you have what can you really do in a situation like this when it's just you you know what i mean all right let's see what lies behind door number one anything here look at this place man is this the research facility yes it is oh what happened here what is this, bro? That's nasty. Look at the size of these little eggs. Alright, what do we have? Oh, wait, is that a person? Hold on. Before anything else, hold on. Let me go in ahead and smash these things, just in case. I've seen Alien, trust me. Oh, that is a body. What the hell happened? Oh, nah. You know what? Hold on. Yeet. Oh, that thing, yeah, that thing devoured its entire head, bro. That poor bastard. Let's get the hell up out of here, man. Before anything else, though, I'm going ahead and smash these little eggs. Just to go on ahead and get rid of them. All right, let me just, just to be safe. I've seen aliens, man. I've seen what happens when these little things tend to open. Look at this. They've been researching these things, man. They've been trying to quote unquote study these things. You don't just do that, in my opinion. Like, you know what I'm saying? And it's always human beings. They tend to always just mess with nature. And then when shit goes left, all of a sudden, oh, what happened? Well, you happened. Look at this poor bastard, man. This is crazy. This is a doctor, dude. All right, well. Now that I know that this entire research facility was overtaken by whatever the hell they were studying... Or at least that's what it looks like in this case, you know? Nah, you're bugging, bro. You must be out of your damn mind if you think I'm gonna stay here any longer than I need to. Nope. And that's the thing, too. I've said this time and time again, that games like this and games like Dead Space and Resident Evil, they directly inspired me to create the story of the Dark Masters and just to incorporate everything that I've been incorporating so far, which I hope you guys have really enjoyed, that it just it really it, it dawns upon me when looking back on it because I'm like man this game is so bloody as well as many others you know that it was directly used as a means of inspiring me to create a lot of my premises for the story of the dark masters and many other things that I have coming in the far future so let me um yeah let me get the hell up out of here this game is giving me the eebie-jeebies man it's it's still a great game though Oh, nah, man. Like, again, you're by yourself. You know what I mean? Like, that's... I think... I think that's the scariest part, you know? Oh, wait, is this it? Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. So, it looks as though I'm gonna have to, like, I guess... Operate something? What the hell? What the hell? Oh? Oh, this... This is a... Uh, this is a prelude to something. Okay. Okay, so I gotta get the code from the guards. Should look for that guard. Okay. So, to my understanding, I guess these guys were gonna, like, nuke the site. Or whatever the hell, you know, was going on here, because... Did y'all just hear that? Oh, hell no, bro. Again... I think it's the sounds that really get to you in games like this. Like, you know what I mean? Nah, bro. There's something out here. Oh, there's something big down here, bro. You can kind of already tell because you can hear it. Hey, yo, who's down here? You about to catch these hands. I don't even know if this is like the... The correct path that I'm supposed to walk down, but I'm just walking down paths anyway, like whatever. 
Man. I'm hearing all types of noises and sounds, but I don't even know if it's like, oh god, what happened here? Look at this. So it's a blood trail, and it leads to that. What is that? All right, let me uh, let me search this place real quick. All right, well, I guess it's time for us to try to scoot our way through this. Let me just go on ahead and uh, please don't wake up. That thing is nasty. Oh, he's awake! Nah, 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 nah. You know what I'm gonna do? Yeet! Just to make sure. I'm not, I'm not chancing anything. Are you, are you kidding me? Oh my god. What happened here? Oh! Oh shit! What the? Alright, hold on. Exposed tentacles will call. Oh, I remember this guy. Okay. Oh, he's mutating! Oh, shit! Oh, hell no, dude. All the me got tinnel. Go, go ahead. Back up. Back up. Is he dead? He's twitching. He's twitching. What, what is this? Tentacles? And yeah, I, I kind of get that already. I, I, it's not my first rodeo. Die! 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 God. All right, is he dead? All right, he's, he's gone. Shoot the tentacles. Oh, man. That poor bastard. So I'm guessing that's the guard from what I remember. I think it is. All right, well... Come here, you poor bastard. I'm gonna have to cut that thing out of you so I can take it and leave. Thank you very much, sir, for your cooperation. Alright, yeah, let's get the hell up out of here, man. This is, uh... This is starting to get a little too much, you know what I'm saying? Alright, um... The drain tank six. Alright, so I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to operate that machinery by using that guard's code. But the thing is... My health is kind of low, so if I remember what I remember to be correct, I think I'm about to fight like these giant monsters or something, but that's only if I remember for this to be like the exact location in which I'm about to do so, because if not, then I think it's, it's the wrong place, but I don't want to find myself in a situation where I'm about to fight these things and then the next thing you know, I just get like eaten alive, you know? So let's see. All right. Oh, hello. Oh, we have a couple of friendlies, huh? Get out of my face. Hey. Oh, God, I missed. Oh, here they come. Oh, God. Oh, here they come. Oh, here they come. Hold on, hold on. I, I may be... Oh, God. I may be underestimating these things. Damn it. Don't touch me. That's right. Come on. Take him down. Come on. That's right. Oh, he's mutating. Jesus. Oh, my health. Oh, I, I am one hit away from dying. Come on, take him out, take him out, take him out. That's right, that's right, take him out. Oh! Oh, no! Oh, no, dude, really? All right, all right, all right, all right. So, I may have underestimated them a little bit. All right, you know what? Nah. Nah, we're running that one back. Hold on. Because I, I know that didn't just happen, like, the way it happened. Hell no. Let me just go in ahead and just make sure that I heal myself up if I can. By grabbing this, okay. Alright, let's try this again. Except this time, I'm gonna try to be a little bit more aggressive towards, like, the first guy. So, where's he at? There he is. Alright, you're gonna have to go, my man. I'm gonna have to- oh god. I'm gonna have to take you out quick. I'm gonna have to take you out quick. Alright, come on, come on. That's right. Is he dead? Oh, shoot him again. Damn it, I have to reload. That guy- Back up, back up, back up. Oh shit. Oh right, yeah, these things are strong. Okay, the first the first one's dead. Come on, come on, take him out. There we go. There we go. Just gotta make sure he's dead. Is, is, like, is he gone? Alright, he's gone. Alright, just to make sure. Just to be safe, you know what I mean? Alright. Yeah, no, I wasn't gonna let that slip on by. Nah. Okay. So we have to activate this. And then hopefully it'll create a bridge for us to go to the next location, right? I'm pretty sure that's what's about to happen, right? Yeah, they're draining it. Wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. Okay. 
So I I don't think this is the uh, the location, right? Where I'm... Wait. Oh yes, it is. Oh my god. It is. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh oh no! Hell no, bro. Ooh. Oh yeah, we definitely have a few anomalies here. Ew, what are those things, bro? I don't even have any bullets. What am I supposed to do? Oh, hello! Yeah, oh yeah, you would've thought! I have the instinctual ability to dodge. Oh god. Oh, come on, take him out. I have no bullets, bro, I need bullets! Come on, a few more. Is he dead? Hold on. Let me just make sure that he's dead. Stupid bum. Alright. Wait, is there another one here, right? Oh, I think there is. Oh, yep, I think there is. Yep, he's right above me. Oh, shit. Oh! Yeet! Nah, bro. Are you insane? Are you insane? Like, what are you? Like, cockroach monsters, bro. Like, what is this? Die! Damn it. Die! Damn cockroach monsters. Out of my face. Oh, this is bad. This is so bad. Because I'm trying to figure out, like, oh! Okay. Is he the last one? He has to be the last one, right? Nah, you're bugging, man. Why? Where's he at? There he is. If that's not terrifying, I don't know what is. Like, just the sheer size of that thing is, like, crawling around on the walls and stuff. Like, nah, bro. Oh, God. Take him out. Come on. Take him out. Oh, is he dead? Right? Let me just make sure. All right. Do we have another one? Like, is there one more? I'm not sure. I'm not trying to chance it, though. But I'm almost certain that there's got to be one more, right? Oh, okay, okay, wait. Never, never mind. Okay. The access hatch is open. Okay. I gotta get the hell out of here, man, before I have more of these, like, Cloverfield monsters chase me. You gotta be bugging out of- you You must be out of your mind! If, if, if you think that I'd be accepting something like this, like, hell no, dude. I don't accept any of this, like, what? It's just me out here. Yo, you hear that? You hear those weird sounds? And oh my god. You're crazy. Alright, uh, we have a hatch down here, okay? So now, I wonder- wait. Oh, there's another one! Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's- oh, uh, damn. Yo, look at the size of that thing's hand. Oh, it's ba it's trying to come in. It's banging. Oh, that thing is banging, bro. I'm, I'm trying to get out of here. What would you guys do in a situation like this? Like, you know what I'm saying? Because, like, you have, like, no other choice but to just go, you know? Alright, where am I? Yeah, where am I? Like, fuck the smell. Where am I? What is this? Oh, that's a... That's, that's terrifying. Oh, God. Alright, well, I'm down here by myself. Oh, this is this is so creepy. I guess I'm going this way. I feel so bad for this guy. Cause like again, I'm just trying to get off this planet. I'm trying to get off of like whatever the hell is happening here. And it's like almost impossible. At this point, like you have to nuke the entire world. You gotta throw this entire body of rock like into the sun. You know what I mean? Pressure check. Wait, what? Gate Wait, what? Gate oh, I remember this. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no! No, 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 no! Oh, this is bad. Okay. Oh, I gotta swim through. Oh, I gotta... Yeah. Oh, I have to... Uh, I have to avoid all this crap. Like, so, like, is this, like, sewer water? Like, you know what I mean? Like, wh like, why are we releasing this water? And, like, what's in it is the question. Oh, God. Oh, this is bad. Oh. Imagine being in a situation like this. Like, this is mortifying, dude. Oh, God. All right. 
This is crazy. Hold on, let me just try to survive. I must try to survive and hold on. Oh, what? Oh, what is that? Oh, jeez. Oh, yo, I almost got torn to shreds. I gotta pay attention, man. This is... I, I, I know I'm gonna hit something on the way down. I just know it. Oh, I just know it, dude. This is... This is freaking nuts. Hold on, I'm trying to... Oh, God. Propellers. No! Ah! Avoid them! Avoid them! Alright, so far so good. I don't... Oh, this is nuts, man. Oh, this is crazy. Oh, wait. Ah, God. Oh, that hurt. Oh, that was... Oh, God. Wait a minute. Ah! I'm dead. I'm gonna die. Oh, I'm gonna die. There, there's no way. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way. I can't even tell what's happening right now, dude! Oh, this is bad. Okay, I'm, I'm still in the fight. I'm still in the fight. Just gotta avoid whatever's here. Ew, look at this. These things have been like... Oh, I knew it! They've been cocooning people here, dude! Get off me! Get off me! Yeah, get... No, get off me, man. Oh, oh, oh. Oh! Grab it, grab it! Holy... Oh, there's another one! Oh, get off me! No, you ugly bitch! Oh, you gotta be kidding me, bro. Oh my god, dude, you gotta be kidding me. I gotta get out of here. First of all, I smacked like two pillars. So like my dude probably has like broken legs. You know what I'm saying? God, this is I'm barely clinging on to my life right here. But we're definitely gonna come back to this because What an adventure that was, right? Like God, I, I, so as long as I'm not anywhere near water right now, I should be all right. Nah, bro. This is wild. My guy probably has broken legs. This is just crazy. Okay, so I have no idea where the hell we're headed, but welcome back to Bigfoot Hunt. I have joined an in-game progress. I managed to collect some weapons, and I don't know, like right now, I, we've been walking around for quite some time, and now that I've gathered everything that I got along with these guys, we're on the hunt, we're looking for this Bigfoot thing. We've seen him prior, we heard him, but we weren't able to actually locate him anywhere, and whoa, what the hell's that? Oh my god, he's right there. Here we go. Oh, here we go. All right, it's four of it's the four of us versus Bigfoot. Holy Jesus, man. This is like This is like our heroes versus like Raijin after his like resurrection in the in the in the sequel of Murno. Dude, shoot him. Gun him down. Go, oh, gun him down. Oh god, what do I have here? I don't have any ammo. I have a pickaxe. Okay. Jump him. Jump him. Hey. Oh man! Oh, we we all oh, we have to. Did he just choke slam me? Oh man! We oh, you know what? I did not ever. Yo, know, we're we're fighting on the road. This is like some Android 18 versus like Vegeta shit. Oh, he's oh god! Let me just hop this. Get him! Jump him! We can take him down. We can take him down. This would be the first time that I believe that, to my recollection, we we actually took down Bigfoot. But I don't know what's about. Oh, I don't know what's about to happen. What happened? Did they stun him? What's going on here? Did you just hear that guy? We gotta, we gotta get the fuck up out of here, man. Oh, this is so... This is really horrifying, dude. Like, dude, he's... He is in hot pursuit. We are shooting this thing and he's not... Let him go, you stupid... Yeah, slow him down, slow him down. He's on fire. He is on fire. How come he's not dying? What is this thing? Dude... This is nuts. What? Like, we just started this, like, not even five minutes ago? And yet, oh, yeah, we're dead. Either we're gonna die, or he's gonna die, straight up. You son of a bitch, you're gonna go down. He's gonna go down. Oh, he's, he's, oh, come on, can I get him? I have no ammo, dude. Yo, stab him. Stab him in the dick. Twist his dick. Do something, guys. Shoot him. Oh, wait. Oh, he's going after that guy. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, he's gonna choke slam him. No! 
Come on, use your pickaxes. Use whatever you got. Come on. Oh, God. I gotta I got get behind here real quick. Stun him. All right. I, damn it. I have nothing. Let me see if I can heal myself. All right. Uh, Am I healing myself? Are, are we good? Are we good? I think, I think I'm good. All right. Let me just use this. Get him. Get him. Oh, damn it. I love how my teammates are like, he knows where we're at. Oh, duh. Like, we're in the middle of the road, dude. Why isn't he die? Yeah, one of yo, listen, either we're gonna go down or he's gonna go down. So here we go. This is don't shoot me, dipshit. Oh, this is bad. Where's he going? He's running away. Get him! Get him! You ain't going nowhere, smelly dick. Where's he going? Hey! Oh, did he really escape? Are y'all really gonna let him escape? Don't let him escape. Damn it. No, no, uh. Did I lose? Yeah, we lost him. I gotta go back, man. I'm not trying to fight that thing with a pickaxe. Man, you know what? Tonight, I think just for the sake of Halloween, I'm gonna watch like a monster film. Do y'all hear my teammates? I want you guys to listen. What the hell is happening? Did he die? Wait, what just happened? Well, oh wait, they're carrying a body. Yeah. Well, Roxanne, the canister. Yeah, this, one, we yeah, this one kid sounds like a complete yeah. goof. Yeah. I don't know where the ritual place is. Are they like they talking over each other? Yeah. I mean, uh, okay, okay. Let me let me just let me just shut my mic off for them real quick. Did you hear that? You're on your own game, or you go? Yeah, yeah. Does it look like I'm okay? Uh, I know where everything in the shower in this area. Oh, 12 o'clock, 12 o'clock. Ah, co what the hell is wrong with these guys, man? Get QRF over here. Focus fire, focus fire, focus fire. Got him. Got him the big. Are y'all are y'all hearing? Yo, did these guys like snort coke before playing this game? Like, what the hell? I'm just making sure that this freaking thing doesn't come up from behind me. I think I know where they're going. I mean. They have their flashlights on, so it's not going to be too hard for me to see them from a distance, but... Yeah, tonight I'm going to watch, like, a monster film. Just because we fought this thing, like, in the middle of the road. And he decided to run away. I thought we were all going to die, I'm not going to lie to you. Guys, I swear to you, I think these two are talking over each other. Because I don't think they're, like, literally communicating at all. Like, at all. Because one of them is, like panic talking and the other one is just babbling on like i have no idea what's going on but are they up here i would encourage for you guys to watch a monster film tonight too just because and by the way i hope you guys are enjoying everything so far if you guys are then give this video a like it literally takes like two seconds and it really goes you know as far as to show uh some love for your boy Listen to them, listen to them. They're arguing. What, what's happening in there? Hold on. I want you guys to listen. Listen, listen closely. We have a random body here. Oh, Jesus. Far left? All right, they're going. Okay, Firewatch Tower. Okay, so let me just let me just check my surroundings. So they're going way far left. They're going to the Firewatch Tower. So I have no idea where that is. I guess. The guy who's on cocaine is going to lead the other brainless guy over there for them to, I guess, meet their doom. I have no idea, but... I need I need ammo, dude. Like, I can't... Um, I can't go about this situation with, like, just a pickaxe. Like, it, it, it's really going to, like, do me injustice if I don't have, like, bullets. These guys are, like, literally... Are, I, I have no idea what, they're, like, they're talking about, but it's so hilarious because I think that they're literally over-talking each other. Nah, bro, listen. I was born and raised in the hood, right in between Brooklyn and Queens. You would never catch me running outside like this with a pickaxe looking for a Bigfoot. Are you stupid? 
that's like some Idaho white people stuff. Like, you know what I mean? Like, you got to be from like Ohio or something, you know? Hey, dude, you want to go out there and like look for Sasquatch, man? Yeah, we'll totally take him down. I have like a lead pipe and a baseball bat. You know what I mean? Eh. All right, where am I going? Um, as a matter of fact, the Ranger Patrol Station. Wait, it's that way. Okay. And that's where I'm going to be going. The Ranger Patrol Station. I have no idea if this is actually going to take me there or if I'm going to just end up dying, but hopefully I don't end up dying. I need some bullets. I need ammo. It looks like Bigfoot is eating some animals because his health is coming back. And so, you know, whatever ends up happening ends up happening. But thus far, I did not even anticipate finding myself in the beginning of this. Just throwing down with Bigfoot in just in the middle of like the highway. Like, you know what I mean? Am I going in the right direction? Yes. Okay. Nah, you got to be crazy, man. You got to be crazy to be doing this out there. I mean, I don't, let, let me know down below. Do you guys believe in, I guess, cryptids? You know, Mothman, Bigfoot, Ogo Pogo in Canada, Nessie in Loch Ness, The Bloop, Julia down by Argentina. Trust me, I know a lot about these things, guys. You have no idea. I mean, it's not really a conspiracy when you think about it, because when you look deep into these things, it's, it's a little scary. It's a little creepy, you know? There's got to be something here. Whoa. Okay, no, that was me closing the door. I was about to say. All right, well, uh, yes, I, I got a car battery. All right. Wait. Oh, shit. Wait, no, he, he's here? Dude. Oh. Oh, my God. I'm by myself. I'm dead. I am so dead. No, don't do this to me. Bro, like, I, I, I could help you. I could bring you to my guys. Why did you have to take me down? You smell like shit. Oh, look at the size of him. Get your balls out of my face. Get your giant balls out of my face. Oh, I am so dead. That, that, that's it for me, man. What? Why? So it has been, and I'm not even kidding here, just about maybe 55 minutes. And so this, the, everything about, whoa. Did they actually find them this time? Yeah, they did. Dude, I mean, you guys have no idea. Because they, so far, we're, we're just about an hour into this. If I haven't already chopped everything up so far. what? It, oh, here we go. I've been waiting for this. Oh, he's throwing shit at them. There we go. They trapped them. All right. Are they going to get him? Are they going to finish him off? Finish him off. I mean, obviously, I died. Yo, finish that thing off, you guys. I mean, how could they not? They have guns with ammo inside. Oh, he's out of ammo? Uh-oh. You missed. Did he miss? Keep it up. Keep it up. He's almost dead. I'm out of ammo. No, I'm kidding. Oh, my God. An hour of this. And, and, and it, 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 it really boils down to this. Is he, is he shooting him? Dude, just jump down. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Get him. Oh, why? He missed. He missed. There's no way. Oh, oh, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Yo, that blue guy has to finish him off. He has to finish him off. Get him. Shoot him. No, you idiot. There's no way they're going to die. He's... No. Dude, really? Come on, man. He's too overpowered. Really? Oh, my... Really? Plan oh my god, is he gonna okay. throw him off the- yeah, he did. I cannot believe this. They they literally had him. It, like, I, I, you know what? These two deserve it, man. That was that was the dumbest plan ever, man. Oh, we literally had this thing. An hour of the- and he's eating us. He's literally eating us, man. GG, what? You know, I'm still kind of pissed off that they weren't able to kill Bigfoot, but either way, welcome back to Dead by Daylight. I'm Leon S. Kennedy, and our mission is to make sure that we just essentially get as many generators running as possible so we can open the chambers and get the hell out of here. Now, the thing is, I don't know what kind of killer was selected here. It could be Nemesis, it could be Ghostface, it could be Pinhead. Oh, we're working on this? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Let's go on ahead and get the first generator up and running here. It's been a little bit of a while, so, uh... 
Back to Dead by Daylight we go. Yo, I'm honestly really salty. Oh, God. That we just... Oh, that, that they couldn't kill Bigfoot, like, on the last game. Like, why? Like, that. I don't know. That that. I mean, playing Bigfoot Hunt can be a hit or miss, you know? Oh, someone, someone's about to go down. Oh, someone's about to go down. Listen, we need to get all of these things up and running because I do not want to die. I do not want to come up short like we just did against Bigfoot and Bigfoot Hunt, but... Either way, let me know down below, do you guys prefer playing as survivors or killers if you happen to play Dead by Daylight? Oh, she's down. Oh, this is bad. Okay, great. Great, great, great. Four more generators. Okay, um... I think I, I think I remember the layout. Okay, oh, we have a person here. Yes. Oh, she got hung. Almost there. Come on, can we get three? We, we have to get at least three generators. Three generators remaining if we're able to activate two of them. Uh-oh. Wait, where's the killer? I don't see them. Oh, shit! Oh, they're using... What is that? What, like, the hag? I think I just shit my pants. Why? Yo, she came up from out of nowhere. I don't even know how I escaped that. I don't even know how they have terrible aim. Like, what? I literally crapped myself. I don't even know where to go. Okay, let me see if I can free her. Hold on. Yo, I literally just crapped my pants. Alright, stop. Stop struggling. Alright, let's go. Wait, were we not able... Oh, there's still four remaining. Are we were not... We were not able to get at least two of them operational? Come on. Oh, I can, I, I can feel her. Where is she? Oh, she, oh my god! Okay, so as long as she doesn't see me, I think we should be okay. Okay. She does not see me. Ah, uh, you know what? I, I gotta get out of here. Oh, I think she's chasing me. Let me just zigzag here. Hold on. Oh, this is not good. Yeah, I think she's chasing me. Is she? I have no idea. The heart, the heartbeats are faint. Um, did we let this one go? We, we need to get this one quick. It's the closest one for us to- Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh no, yo, guys, oh, we've all been slashed except for one person. I, I have to zigzag. Don't get me, you damn hag. Oh, come on, Leon. You've endured so much worse. You've endured, you know, Mr. X. You've endured, you know... Oh, God. You've endured all of Resident Evil 4. You've endured William Birkin. You've endured so much, man. Oh, okay, okay, we have three more to go. There is a possibility that, we, that we're able to still do this, so... Let me heal myself. I think I'm far away from them. As humanly possible. Now, I'm starting to wonder which generator... Did they manage to get, because... I don't want to run... I mean, there's three of them there present right there, but... I don't know, I mean... Is it is it the one far away? I, I mean, you know what, at this point, it doesn't even matter. So as long as we're able to just... Get them all operational, we should be fine. And let me know down below as to what kind of horror games or just games in general that you guys want to see me play for other gaming roulette videos. Because, I mean, these things are just so much fun. Oh, no, not again. Is this one, is this one good? Oh, wait, almost, almost. Yes, 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 come on. Oh, my God, she's back again, dude. Oh, she's going to get the girl. Get the girl. Don't get me. Don't, 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 don't get me. I'm just, I'm, I'm an innocent bystander, bro. I have no beef with you. I have no beef with you, hag. Get her. I'm luring the hag towards that girl. Oh, oh, wow. She actually got it. Wow, I can't believe it. I'm so sorry. I'm such a dick. I can't believe it. I'm such a dick. Oh, I can't believe I just did that. I circled around her and the hag must have saw her, like the girl healing in between the bush and she was like, not today. Oh, she got, oh, she got meat hooked. I'm sorry, lady. I had to do what I had. I, I just had to do it. I, I had to do what I needed to do. I'm so sorry. I promise I'll try to get you down. Just don't die on me. Okay, you help me. Let's do this. So as long as she doesn't come in the area, we should be fine, right? Oh, I spoke too soon. Where are you going? Oh, there she is. Okay, don't get me. Don't get... Okay. Okay, hold on. Yo, we could talk this... Oh, we could talk this out, lady. Jesus. Don't. 
Don't, don't, don't. Please. Oh, what the fuck? Yo. I literally jumped. Oh, God, I'm bleeding out of my ass. Why? Why? No, get away from me. Don't, don't. Oh, you ugly bitch. Don't do it. No. Come on. Get off me. Get off me. Please. Get off me. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh, help me. Help me. There's a police officer who fought zombies and bioweapons in multiple countries here. Help me. I could be of aid. I could be of aid. Please. Help me. Or just leave me hanging here. I mean, I guess. But help me you. Yes, please. Help me. I'm bleeding out of my ass. Okay, let's see. Okay. Okay, we should be fine. We should be fine. Yo, we have three gener- Oh, okay, that, that girl scared the crap out of me. Whoa, what do you want? What do you want? What? Stop touching my ass. Why is she- Why is she- Why is she flashlighting my ass? Oh, I see. Oh, she wants to heal me. Okay. All right, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Oh, my God. Oh, my- Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, hell no. Get away from me. Yo, you gotta be kidding. You've got to be kidding. You've got to be I mean, I know that it's been, like, a long time since I went back to play this, but, I mean, you've got to be kidding. And especially during the month of Halloween, like, nah, man. Oh, she's after me. Or she's after somebody. I, I mean, you can feel it. There's got to be... Yo, we have to reduce, like, the amount of generators. Because right? we're going to end up dying. There's no way. We can't even... We cannot get it down past three. If we can get three generators operational, that that's that's a good sign. So I'm going to try my best. This thing is falling apart. Come on. Oh, she got... Okay, wait. Okay, wait. She's way far away, okay? Okay, so... Okay, this is good. Oh, we have two... Yes! Two more. Two more. Two more. Two more. Which means that... Which means that if I can get this one fully fixed, then we'll only have one more. Okay, good. Oh, this does not sound good. You can hear the screams in the background, dude. I am trying my best to make sure that this does not end up backfiring on me, because... Alright, let's see. Alright. You know, this... This plus the Dark Master story is... It's just... It's stress-inducing, you know what I mean? Oh my god, all we need is one more, right? Right? One more after this. One more? Oh, don't, don't creep up on me like that, please. Yes! One more! I can smell freedom. Okay, there's one up here. I can literally smell freedom. Oh, and I can smell her too. Where is she? Please don't find me. Where is she? Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, no, man. Help. She's going to take me to her freaking dungeon. Get off of me. And the thing is right there, too. No, damn it, please. Damn it. Yeah, this is... Oh, God. Yeah, the, yeah. I, I think I'm going to die. If someone doesn't help me right now, I mean, we're, we're going to die. All we need is one more. We need one more. That's it. Just one more generator for us to move forward. But, I mean, how... This is, this is so stress-inducing. This has got to be the most stress-inducing thing. Help me, thank you. Okay, run. There's got to be, there's got to be one generator. That's like, oh, it's, oh, this one's from the beginning. Damn it. Oh, what's happening? Oh, she got her. Okay, oh, oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'm, yeah, oh, damn it. You know what? I'm out of here. There's got to be, no, there's got to be another generator. There has to be. Because I'm not doing that one from the beginning. And I just exposed my location, so that's not good. Let me see if this one... Uh, this one's got to be fresh, or if there's any... Is this one good? Okay, yes, uh, it is. Let me see. Maybe I can... Maybe I can free her and then start lifting that generator, right? Oh, damn it. Did I make a noise? Oh, God. Okay. Okay, listen to me. Um... Okay, okay, great, 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 we're all here. Oh my god. Okay. We can do this. We can do this. 
Run, Leon. God, where is she? Where is she? I have to zigzag. Where is she? Oh my god, where is she? Oh my god, she can't see me. Oh my god! Oh my god, we tricked her! We actually tricked her! What a goof! Hehe. <laughs> Did you really think you would be able to outsmart me? Okay, I need to make sure that she doesn't find me. She could be chasing somebody else. While I get this last generator up and running, so then that way we can get up the hell up out of here. Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? Where is she, dude? Oh my god! No! No, no! I'm dead. I'm, uh, yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead. Get off me. Please get off me. No, no. Don't do this. 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 Get off me. Get off me. Don't do this. I'm dead. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh, yeah. That was the third one. Damn it! Yo, we were so close. You guys have no idea. We're definitely going to be running that back. We're definitely going to be running that back because how is it that I get murdered? I mean, there's one more generator, man. It's it's up to them. GG, man. Damn it. Okay, so I said I was going to run this back and here we are. Let's see. I don't know. I mean, I doubt this is the same map, but okay, let's go on ahead now and see if we can get all of these generators operational because I am trying to escape and for a lot of my like older experiences oh my god this is the beginning they're already here where where oh shit oh no 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 dude we just started oh i'm try i trapped myself oh god we just started why like we just started and he just like slashed me across my face bro Right, let me just oh what is this it's a bear tra oh my god i'm trapped oh god get me out of here get me out of here oh wait oh i can hear him i can hear him he's coming he's coming no please god hold on let me see if i ah! oh you could suck my ass man this dude looks like some of the demons that i made in the Murno sequel that's right oh good job yes freedom liberation i have been liberated i must get to freedom I must find my freedom. I must open those gates so I can get out of here. Damn it. I don't even have a med pack, dude. Oh, this is bad. All you hear is like Leon groaning like... All right, we need to... We need to strategize. Okay, let me see. I mean, be the, be the fact that like I'm all the way out here. I don't see... The killer going all the way out here just to get me? Because I'm pretty sure he's preoccupied with the others. So I think I think we're safe. I think we'll be able to get this. But then again, I have no idea. But I guess we'll find out. Yo, this is terrifying. I'm just making sure to look at like both directions. The right-hand corner and the left-hand corner because if I see anybody moving from either side, I'm running in the opposite direction. I don't... Yo, I don't... Uh-oh. Okay. I, I don't... I really don't know if we're going to be able to do this. I mean, may, maybe I can... I'm trying to pay attention because I see... Okay, damn. I saw like a little bit of movement, so I thought something was going on is he is he about to meet hook one of them i think he is oh i messed up damn it i i, I pay attention pay attention now nah, we can't we can't go down like this bro we just can't oh he meat hooked him oh he meat hooked him that's that's not good you guys can we get some of the other generators to be running operational please like well, like what is that one that oh damn it oh damn it no literally like we could at least have it down to four and and it's up to me doing it by myself messing this up twice come on gentlemen help me someone or at least you know all right just fuck off i, I guess at this point right because i literally did this by myself hold on let me just do that and oh god oh god he's coming okay four i did all of that by myself dude damn birds get out of my face where is he Oh, where is he, bro? He's here somewhere. Where is he? I don't see him. Oh, okay. Hold on. 
Let me see what my options are. Maybe. Oh, this is bad. Let me. I don't know. Maybe. All right. I'm going to get this down to three. I'll, 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 listen, I'm going to try to win this. And I think this is a good vantage point that I have because uh, he's carrying some. Well, he's all the way back there. Okay. So this means we have time. We have time to do this. Because if he's all the way out there, then there's no way he's going to get to me. Right? Right? I mean... Oh, I, I see him. He's walking around. See, this is kind of good because be that as I can see him moving around, that just means that he could stay over there while I do my business here. So if I can get this down to three... I think those two are about to get it down to three too and then we'll just have two more left and then boom we can just do, we, we can just turn on the last two generators and just bounce okay come on guys i'm fumbling and bumbling and stumbling around back here come on come on leon if i get caught by i think he's gonna go after them but we have to get that person that was meat hooked over there because if we don't then we're gonna be down a player oh, wait, oh yeah he's chasing them he has to yeah, he's got to be chasing them. He's got to be chasing them. There's no way they just stopped doing that. Oh, yep. I knew it. Okay, come on. Come on. Okay, yes. Yo, listen. I'm out here doing everything by myself. Come on. Y'all got to give me some credit here. Ah, uh, he got him. He's over there. All right, so while he chases that guy, I'm going to try my best to, like, just get this up and going. And so, Oh, God. Oh, I messed up. Oh, no. Please don't come to me. Please don't come to me. Please don't come to me. Is he... Okay. He's still chasing the other guy, which is good. Okay. I, I mean, at this point, that other guy is going to have to get the other two down from those meat hooks. Because I'm too busy being preoccupied by, like, you know, just operating all of these generators. You know what I mean? And so while he... Uh-oh. No. 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 No, no, no. No, 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 damn it, no, no, not like this, bro, not like this, not like this, not like that, oh, he helped the other guy, okay, hold on, help me, get off of me, oh, this is so bad, okay, wait, 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 ah, oh, damn it, wait, okay, there's a chance, hold on, okay, one of us, okay, 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 so, one of our teammates is dead, the other two are there, guys, oh, he's down, yeah, oh, it's up to this guy, yo, help me, Help me, help me, help me. Yo! We're, you're literally across from me, bro. Like, help me out. He's carrying the other guy. Help me. Yes. My direction. Oh, he oh he hung him right there, too. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that, that, this is real bad. Oh, that, okay, okay. Yo! Oh! This guy's going to meet God. Oh, that guy just went to go meet God. Help me. This is your chance. Oh, I don't... Even even if he's around the area, just... You can't let me die, bro. Like, you need me. You cannot get three generators by yourself. That's like an impossibility. So help me. Oh, no. Help me help you. Yes, yes. Help me, help me. Yes, help me. Dude. Dude. Oh, I'm dead. I'm gonna die. Oh, I'm gonna die. Dude. This is your only... What is he doing? This is your only chance to help me. Oh, this is, this is god-awful. Is he gonna help me? I have no idea. Don't, don't let me go down like this, bro. Don't let all of us fail. I mean, there's only... What is he doing? What are you... Help me. You're, you're literally... Dude, I'm gonna die. Help. My guy. My guy. Why are you running in the opposite direction? Listen, if you guys end up playing with me on Dead by Daylight, please help me. Yes, help me out. Help me out. Oh, he's running. Help me out. You have no choice, bro. You have no choice. He's going to down him. He's going to down him. It's over. It's over. Damn it. That's that's the second game. Dude, help. Get me off of here and I'll be able to... Yeah, I'm dead. Oh, man. Yeah, that's it. That's it. I was not... Yo, listen. I was not expecting for the outcome to be like this. Because that other guy is as good as dead. Like, he's finished. And he's already carrying him. So that was it. We lost. We lost due to sheer stupidity, and I was the one doing everything, man. Jesus. GG, man.
Now, I don't really know whether or not I should be excited or concerned given that I am being joined by a bunch of Randys in doing this, but welcome back to Devour. Okay, so where, where's the key for us to unlock these little Moros into getting them to go back into the house? Okay, so I was really feeling it tonight, so I wanted to kind of test my luck to see if we can actually do this. So I'm going to go on ahead and collect all of the food here, right? Got the cage key. All right. Let these little moros out, shall we? Set them free. Oh, there they go. All right, let's go on ahead and follow them. Jesus. These little things must be so strong to knock a whole door over, like, you know what I mean? And they just disappear into the wall. Oh, that's... That's not good. Right, I guess we're speed running through this. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh, good God, man. Okay. Let us proceed. Oh, I thought that was a little goat there for a second. If you guys have any, like, suggestions for a horror movie to watch, then let me know down below. I would love to watch something different. Um, what I think I might do, because I haven't watched it, I think I might watch Boogeyman tonight. Yo, what is... What is that sound? Like, it sounds like someone's in VC just, you know, making those freaking sounds. But let me see here. There's got to be a goat down here. Hold on. There's got to be because I already have the the seller key, right? Moro? Oh, there he is. Hey, buddy. Come here. I just want to throw you into the fire. Come on. Come on. Come on. That's right. Come on. Come on. Gotcha, bitch. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Time for us to sacrifice this little thing and be done with this. We can actually, you know, get through. I mean, I doubt we'll be able to, like, claim victory here because, again, I'm playing with Randy's. I don't know whether... All right, well, they gathered all the gas tanks. Um, Nobody's going to... Oh, damn it. Do I have to do everything myself? You get in there, you. All right, time to pour this in here. So now I think things are about to get very interesting being that I'm about to burn this little thing here. So here we go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. Well, the Dark Masters are now free. Raijin's on the loose. Let me see if I can... Uh, and I've said this time and time again before, too. When going back to looking at, you know, what I could do for the story of the Dark Masters, I looked at so much cinema, so many games... And you'd be in, like you'd be surprised on how much you can be inspired by to get ideas from like with with cinema with other video games stuff like that like you know what I mean Who the hell threw all those knives into the wall there Oh You better back up lady I ain't playing with your bitch ass let me just uh crap I don't even know what difficulty we we're, we're playing on I think we're playing on either hard or normal Oh, this sucks, man. I think it I think it is hard. I'm not gonna I think we're playing on the hardest not not the hardest difficulty, but on the hard difficulty. Oh hello! Well you thought you thought you could just sneak up on me, huh? Alright, I really hope that these guys know what they're doing because at this point right now, like we need to throw nine more little goats into the fire so we can get rid of like this demon here, so And you know what? When going back to this game and playing it with either Randy's or just like, you know, a group. It's so fun. So my my thing is if you guys want to, you know, play a game together or play with randoms, definitely play Devour. It's it's fun as shit. So I got the kitchen key. Oh god, I hear them. This like this makes me not want to be a homeowner. Like at like living in a big house by yourself. Because oh shit. All right, let's not go over there. Because imagine just hearing sounds like this in the oh, in the middle of the night, you know. All right, come here, Moro. Oh, no, don't, don't, don't run. Don't run. Gotcha. All right. Um, what are what are the others doing though? Like, I don't see them gathering goats. I don't see them doing anything. Oh, there's another one down the hallway. Get out of the way. All right, this is uh. This is going to get crazy. Because at this point, I don't... Here we go. 
I don't know, like, what they're doing, you know? Because I'm the one that's lighting it up and throwing these things in here, you know? Oh my god, can you imagine these guys don't know how to play? Oh no. Alright. Alright, this is, this is good, because we laid out all of the hay here. Uh-oh. Oh, you can hear her. Come here, you. Damn, bro, I'm gonna be the one that's gonna be throwing all these things into the fire? Like, what about my team? Oh, hell no. What do you guys think? Like, do you guys believe, like, in the supernatural? When it comes down to stuff like that? Like, demons and witchcraft and black magic and, like, portals and, like, opening dimensions and, like, you know what I mean? Like, stuff like that, you know? Let me know down below. Alright, things are gonna get interesting now. God. God, this is... Alright, um... Do y'all have any goats? Or is it just me here? Like, what's going on, man? Okay, yeah, it... it I think it's just gonna be me here. Because so far, I threw three in there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yo, this is... This is terrifying. Did that thing, like, run past me? Any little morals around here? No? Any little goats? Damn, son. I, I just... I did not want to be in this situation, like... And plus, be that as it may, I don't even know what the others are doing, man. Like, how could they not have collect co collected, collected a single goat? Like, it's just literally me. Alright, I got the kitchen key. The sh Where's the shared bathroom? That's what I want to know. Is the shared bathroom upstairs? It's got to be upstairs. Right? Yo, if she grabs me and, like, murders me, bro, then... What is that? Uh, let me just grab that. Okay. If she murders me, man, then... That's it for all of us, because so far I'm the only one doing stuff. Like, how come we don't have, like, four or five, six goats in there already? Like, you know? Well, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I'm a little nervous, yeah. Alright, come on, where... I, what I want to know is, like, what are they doing? What are y'all doing? Oh, finally, y'all y'all are collecting a goat, finally. There's, like, three of us just standing around one goat. Alright, uh, children's room is pretty creepy. Yeah, this is... Like, again, imagine just being a person just going through a house like this. Like, are you crazy? Let me know down below if you guys... Oh, crap. A moving chair. That's not, that's not creepy at all. Let me know if you guys are... Oh, I need the guest bedroom key. Damn it. Let me know, like, what are some of the movies that you guys have been watching or are going to be watching for this Halloween season? Because, like I've mentioned, I want to try out Boogeyman. I want to try out just a few other movies. Ooh. What's happening? Oh, four. Yes, finally. Finally, I'm not the only one doing things. Oh, God. All right. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Ding. Oh, shit. Get her. Oh, that's... Back up. She better not. Where's she going? Oh, she's chasing one of them. I do not want to be caught up in that situation, bro. Like, imagine she just creeps up on me. Oh, no. No, don't bring her up here, homie. Yo, you can hear her. Why does it sound like it's getting louder? Oh! No! No, no, no! No! Oh my god, wait a minute. I'm out of- I'm out of UVs! Oh no, dude, this is it for me. No. Oh my god, she's literally chasing me, bro. She's literally chasing me. She's literally chasing me. I'm afraid to turn around, hold on. Oh, she is! She's chasing me! Are you kidding me? 
Yo, I am so terrified. Hold on, because she's literally on my ass. I need to bring her to somebody else. Get away from me. Oh. Oh, oh my god. Did I did I shake her? I did I really just shake her? Yo, I shaked her. Oh, that's awesome, dude. All right, y'all need to back up. Yo, that was crazy. Yo, that was li I've never I've never done that before. She was on my ass. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen her through like the corner of my eye. Where, what are they doing? Well, why? Like, yeah, grab him. Like, why? Why was he in the room alone with him? That's right. Grab him. This is going to be halfway through. Are we actually? I will. I was going to say, are we actually going to do this? I doubt it. Because, like, look, they're, they're not even putting the freaking thing into the fire. Like, damn it. All right. This is going to make five, right? And there we are. Five. Halfway there. Okay. Oh, boy. Now she's pissed. Now she's pissed. All right, gentlemen, ladies. I need y'all to assist me on this one. Instead of being trapped in, like, the, the freaking rooms with the goats and, like, not doing anything with them. I need y'all to grab the other five so we can do this, please. Oh, there we go. Yeah, this marks six. Come on. As long as I don't get tagged. Oh my god. Oh my god, she's right there. Holy god. Yo, yo, yo. Can y'all, can y'all like... Can y'all like help me? Oh god. Put the fire, put the fire, put the fire. Okay, yes, yes, yes. Holy... Oh my god. Dude. I'm all out of UVs, bro. Oh my god. Alright, you know what? I'll do it. Oh, she got her, bro. She got her right in front of my face. Um, yeah, that's it. Oh, she's being dragged out there. Okay, um. Yeah, like, what the fuck, dude? Like, what? Yeah, she's gone. But, like, I have a goat, so, like, I can't... Oh, this is this is so bad. I have a goat in my hand. I can't just drop it to pick up the gas canister. Like, you know what I mean? I can't I can't do that. Oh man, well, I'm stuck in a situation. Yo, I need oh, I need them to do something. I can't just put two of them in there. Yo, what do we do? Oh, do I oh, do I drop it? Do I drop the goat? I don't Oh, you know what, man? Jesus Christ. I eh. I want to see if I can run back and capture him again. Oh, please let me capture him. Yo, grab it. Don't, don't, don't scare the goat away. Oh, crap. Seven. We're about to make eight. We're about to make eight. Come here, you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. So help me God. Come on. Come on. Come on. I need to do this. I need to. So even if I could just put him in there. Come on. There we go. Oh, Jesus, that scared the crap out of me. All right, there we go. Oh, we're about to do it. Yo, I I did the majority of the work here. I collected, like, what, seven of them, eight of them, you know? I threw seven of them in there while one person just threw one in there. Like, you know what I mean? Oh, now, now this is going to be ramping itself up. This is going to be interesting. Oh, this is... Oh, my God. All we need is one more. Oh, this is going to be a make or break moment right now. Can we actually do this? Can we actually do this? Oh, it's going to get hard from here, bro. All right. Uh, Did you get him? Okay. Oh, this is going to be so hard. Where is the last goat? Oh, back up. Oh, back up. You stop touching me. 
All right, I need to get the hell out of here. All right, this is this is the part where things are gonna get a little, a little spicy. Where's the last goat? Guys, where where is it? Anyone? Oh. What is she doing? Oh no! oh no, dude. Damn. Wait, but that one guy was like up there, so she was trying to get him, but she couldn't really get him. Oh, that's terrifying. Put me down, you witch. Oh, we did it. 10 out of 10. Oh, GG, guys. What? That's right. We win. Holy, yo, I can't believe we actually did it. What the hell? And I'm like, I'm dying on the floor. Oh, that was good. That was really good. I swear to you, I was not expecting for us to actually like lay claim and get the victory here. Like what? GG, my brethren. That was, that was so good. And now she's going to get burned alive. That was crazy, and she, I mean, I was like, what is she doing? And then I look on over and she's like, trying to get the other guy. Is this it? Is this it? Yeah. Into the foyer. Into the foyer you go, devil. Be gone. Yeah, that's right, yeah. Yeah. Burn. Oh, shut up. And she'll be waiting with me. Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> yeah! Yeah, we did it, boys! <laughs> oh, we did it. Oh, we did it, man. That was nuts. GG, guys. GG. Okay, so I know that it's been quite some time, but welcome back to Skinwalker Hunt, and that is exactly what we're going to be doing right now, and that's hunting skinwalkers, which... God, man. Okay, so... I'm playing on the most difficult of difficulties, and after watching Antlers, because I just saw Antlers for the first time a couple of days ago, what is this? Alright, nah, man, when there's a church in the middle of nowhere... And it looks abandoned like this. I mean, I don't know. What do we have here? A tactical vest. Okay. So, I... Whoa. Hey, yo! Oh, hell no. What the f... Hold on. Oh, no. Listen. If this was me IRL, you would never catch me dead walking into a, like any building, let alone a church, in the middle of nowhere that looks like desecrated like this, you know? It's run down, torn down, let alone having the cross fall down, windows shattering. Like, nah, man. Uh-oh. We have ghosts around here? I gotta get out of here. Okay, so I think what I want to do is I want to make my way up towards, like, that radio tower. Because I do so solemnly believe that up here is where there's this cave. In case you guys may have remembered on my previous gaming roulettes. And inside of this cave, I think that's where... The skinwalker basically takes you to like devour you and stuff. So after watching Antlers for the first time, because it is a movie about skinwalkers, I was like, you know what? Like, I really want to go back to a game like this. And so here we are. And you know what? I honestly do miss it because I haven't played this game in like what? Maybe two years, right? Give or take. That I can remember, of course. I got to watch my surroundings, man. This is so out there. Like, I don't know. I've, I don't have... Ooh, what was that? Oh, hell no. I don't have friends that live in the middle of nowhere that would ever volunteer to be like, hey, man, you want to go hunting or like just camping in the middle of nowhere? Because even if that was offered to me, I would still say no. Why? Well, because you just never know what's out there. And call me what you will. It's just it's just the truth. So I, uh, I got to see. Let me see. We're definitely going to come back to this, though. There's the cave. Because now that I'm getting reimmersed into this game, like, oh, oh, what the, f yo, oh, it's a wolf, get it, back, holy, yo, where'd that wolf come from, hold on, no, oh, damn it, I do not want to die, bro, wow, dude, like, oh, oh, that's a bear, no, 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 oh, really, come on.
Okay, that did not favor me at all. And so what I want to do is I want to make my way back to see if, like, whatever's in that cave. Because I do believe that there's, like, this ritualistic item in here that I can knock over. And I think from there I'll be able to, like, summon the skinwalker, right? So be that as it may, if anyone can, like, point me out to, like, the nearest location where I can have, like, a shotgun or an assault rifle. Because, like, bro, I got a hunting rifle. Like, you know what I mean? I mean, be that as it may, the bullet's pretty, it's pretty large, but I mean, it's really not going to do damage against, you know, this supernatural being, whatever the hell it is. Look at this cave, man. Look at this. This thing has been eating people, bro. Watch this. Eat. Uh-oh. Oh, man, he tore into this girl. All right, it's coming. I mean, but what do you guys think? Do you guys believe in skinwalkers? I mean, be that as it may, it could, I, you can either identify it as being, like, extraterrestrial. Oh, he tore into this dude's leg. Extraterrestrial. Perhaps maybe a government project. Perhaps maybe a demon. You know what I mean? Like, let me know. If, of course, you guys believe in the supernatural. Oh, it's coming. I have to wait for it, dude. I have no idea where this thing is going to come from. But, and you know, I kind of, if you go back to like my Dark Master story, I do have, I would say two characters, one in particular that I definitely was inspired by the Skinwalker in creating, the other one not so much, but it's, it's one of those like dark, devilish like wizards that I have. I don't want to get like too much into like the lore because it's going to spoil a lot of things moving forward but uh while i'm looking for this thing i mean listen the skinwalker had to have been far away if he's nowhere to be seen right now and that's a fact oh hell no bro but i swear to god it's like it's games like this that inspire me to create some of like the characters that i have going on oh wait There he is! Oh, there he is! Nah, bro. Where did he just come from? Let me back up here for a second before I die. I'm, I'm one strike away from dying. Hold on. Where you at, homie? Oh, hell no, bro. I know I shouldn't even be here right now. What a messed up situation, but I do hope that you guys have been enjoying everything so far on the channel, including the previous gaming roulettes. Watch them. It would really go a long way. He's not coming back, is he? Damn. Bro, all I have is a hunting rifle. Like, you know what I mean? Like, what am I supposed to do with a hunting rifle? If I ever went into a situation where, like, Oh, yeah, me and a bunch of friends are going to go out looking for, like, a skinwalker. I'm going to be armed to the T. I'm talking about, like, and I know this is a little unrealistic, but chainsaw, shotgun, freaking extended Glock, a machete, a cross, some holy water, you know, stuff like that. Not no freaking rifle and, like, a little a little hatchet. Like, like what am I supposed to do with that? But hold on. I know this is a death sentence right now. Where am I? Okay. Alright, so... Nah, bro, this is not... You know what? I'll just say this much in case you guys are watching this far in. For my story of the top 5 strongest in the multiverse that I'm currently working on as well behind the scenes, I just might... Oh, I'm not going back in there. I just might make another character that kind of resembles, you know, a skinwalker maybe to fight against like Budo or something. I don't know. Definitely going to be adding a whole bunch of crazy stuff in that story hands down and what i will say and this is an exclusive i'm gonna have a few of those strongest guys such as maybe akuma yoshido takira depending on who i'm gonna have them fuse oh, oh that's the campsite okay yeah you heard me i'm gonna have two of them maybe three of them maybe all four of them fused together who knows i don't want to give away what i have planned i mean but you'll see and I think you I think you guys will like it. All right, let me um Let me see what we got going on here. 
Whoa, hold on. Whoa! Oh, it's a worshiper! Oh no, hold on, back up. Oh, this is bad, hold on. Yo, I was not a I, I completely forgot about these guys. Hold on. Oh, it's been a minute. Hold on, it's been a minute. I will not I refuse. Damn it! Oh you know what? Damn. Nah, we're gonna run that back. We're definitely gonna come back to this because where the hell did he just come from? Like from out of nowhere, right? Damn. Now, I couldn't think of a better way than to end off this gaming roulette special than by going back to the Resident Evil 1 remake, and boy, do we have a lot to do. So based on your feedback, I have quite a few things that I need to go on ahead and do because again, it's been a long time since I went back and I played this and having to select a random saved game data I think is a little difficult, especially when you're on and off on a certain game like how I am with this. So I kind of have to, you know, go back and retrace my steps to see where I'm at to kind of get a better understanding and gauging out where I am and what I need to do. And so let me head out to the to the graveyard real quick, because I know that at some point, I believe I'm going to have to fight the snake first once I acquire. I think it's the shield key. And then from there, I think I'm going to be able to access different parts of you know, the mansion, the residence, and all that kind of stuff, so I need to find a way to get behind here. I think this has something to do with those colored murals, but I just want to make sure that there's nothing that I left behind here, because if I did, then boy, would that suck? What is this? Uh, I can't go past this, right? Man, the ambiance for this game. Oh, that's right, I can't carry any more shotgun shells. Okay, I need to definitely get rid of my broken shotgun and get the real shotgun again i'm readjusting myself back into playing this game because i really am trying to kind of like survey the area just to kind of see where i need to go and what i need to do but i mean with this game being as old as it is even playing it now during the month of october in 2024 oh there's a okay wait a minute uh i don't think i need that right no, I don't, because I know I put that there to open the catacombs down here. Because at some at some point, I'm going to have to collect the uh, death masks and then fight the uh, crimson zombie that's trapped in that coffin up here. So I just want to make sure that I have everything kind of like packed down, because I know that in that coffin right there, that zombie, once I end up beating him, He's going to end up giving me like a little emblem that I'm going to have to use to open up one of the doors. And so I just want to make sure that I have all of the clues that I need to uh, kind of get all of the death masks in order for me to fight the Crimson Zombie and whatnot. So again, even after so many years with this game, this game is so visually pleasing only because like, again, it's a very old game and you would think, OK, you know, it's really not all that, but it actually is. And so I implore you all, again, I'm not sponsored by Capcom, but go back and if you haven't played this game, play it. If you have played it before, then just for the month of Halloween, just go back and play it again. I promise you, you guys will not regret it. So is there any way? Damn it, I can't. Oh, this sucks, man. This was definitely during the days where you really couldn't carry that many items. That sucks. Um, is there anything? I just want to make sure that I don't leave anything behind. Yeah, this is going to suck. All right. So for the most part, a lot of these doors are locked because I don't have the one key that I need in order in order to, for me to make my way through. But let me see. Um, I just want to check a few more things here. OK, so I think I know where I need to go. And you know, what's kind of sad, like back in the day when Resident Evil 5 came out and I've been very transparent about this Resident Evil 5, like especially following four, I wanted to like that game so much, but then it went into like, kind of like it being an action based game towards the middle and end. And then of course, RE6 was a complete mess. In my opinion, it doesn't even matter what campaign we're talking about here. So I'm actually glad to see what they did with seven, with a, with all of the remakes and just kind of solely grounding them in allowing for them to be survival horror games. You know what I mean? But even to that, like, with like the music and and that's one of the most disappointing things like some of the music for the older games like this are so good that we just don't have them 
you know, for the remakes, and that really bums me out personally, so... Oh, I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! Oh, no! I gotta get out of here. Oh, Jesus! They used the armor key. There's no further... Oh, yes. Okay, uh, let's get rid of that. Oh, that was close. Did you see the way I just football juked him? Bro. Oh, what the hell? Oh, I remember this place. I think this is like the, uh... The bug collection place, right? Something like that. I need to collect... Something on the walls here, but I'm just trying to... I'm just trying to survey the area. Use the lockpick. Uh, alright, I get... Actually... Let me grab one of these. Just in case. You'll never know. Because we got a crimson head out there, right? So... There might be one in here too, which I doubt. But let me see here. Anyone here? Oh boy. Yeah, I remember this place. So... If memory serves me correct, yeah, I, I'm gonna have to collect these and do something with them. I just forgot because it's been so long. And I've said this time and time again, for a lot of the, you know, grounds in which I've based my fan mangas off of, specifically with the Murno sequel, you know, just going back onto games like this and other horror games, that's what inspired me to create so many. Oh yeah, that's rotten ass water. They've been conducting experiments up in here, man, that's crazy. So. You know, a lot of these games were directly, you know, inspired, you know, for me to go back on and just create a lot of those demons that you guys saw in the demon realm, etc, etc. So there's more that I want to touch up on in the future. So I guess I'll get into that as soon as I can. But let me, I need to sort this out because I know I need to put these damn things together. But, uh, okay, nothing happens. Yeah, maybe there's something. Okay, so I'm going to have to, I believe from what I can remember, I'm going to have to combine those and then I think switch them to my understanding at least and then from there I should be able to get something or whatever let's see what's behind this door here there's so much for me to do I'm starting to like remember little by little oh is anybody in here any zombies underneath the bed here or what this is so creepy dude alright um can't carry this like and to think right you're in this random place where like this mansion is and someone lit up candles there's light all over like this mansion you know it's just it's very weird stuff i'm gonna have to replace that broken shotgun man it's really bothering me because i, I had a few people kind of tell me on the uh, previous gaming roulette hey did you not swap the shotgun out and i said to myself you know I should have went ahead and did that, you know, and I, I guess I'll do that either now or later, but I'm just trying to survey the area because I know that there is more for me to check out, more for me to explore, and I really don't want to leave this place because I know that the Crimson Head is right there, but let me, uh, let me try anyway. And again, I really hope that you guys have been enjoying everything so far, to which if you guys have, then where is he? Oh god, where is he? Hold on, let me... Ooh, oh hell no, did you see that? Did you see the nails on this dude? Yeah, boy, that boy got claws. Yeah, it's definitely not here either. Damn it, I think I went to the wrong room. Which, uh, which key is this? Hold on. Yeah, the helmet. Yeah, damn it, I need the shield key and the helmet key. Alright, well... I'm gonna have to make my way back out there, which I really don't want to because... If I go back out there, dude, I'm gonna have to end up fighting Crimson Face. Which, it's gonna suck, because I have to leave this place anyway. And so, I'm just trying to see if there's anything that I left behind in order for me to... Yeah, I'm gonna have to run my ass across and, like, hopefully don't get caught. To where, again, if you guys are enjoying all of this, then I do hope that you guys subscribe and also hit that like button as well. It also goes a very long way to help me out. And so, I guess, uh... Let's do this. Where is he? Yeet! Okay. Alright. Alright. Is he down? Wait, no, I don't I don't think he's down, right? Is he down? Okay. Alright, I'm not gonna lie, that lightning kind of scared me. These crimson heads, man, like the crimson zombies are insane. And so, being the fact that I completely forgot about them when going back to this, I got mauled, you know, prior, so. 
Oh, I guarantee. Yo, yeah, nah. That that dude right there is about to get up too. I promise you. He's gonna get up too. He's gonna become one of them. Oh, this sucks. So let me. What, what I'm gonna try to do here? The doorknob doesn't. Yeah. Yeah, I think I think at some point this door ends up like breaking down on me, so I can't even go through it either. Oh, this sucks. Any zombies around here? No. Yeah, I need to unlock some of these damn doors, man. Like, for example, like this one right here. I completely forgot, like, the Spencer family emblem is carved into... Yeah, I need to... I completely forgot how to, like, open this one door. So... I think the first thing that I'm going to try to do is I want to collect all of the death masks. Because once I'm able to do that, then I'll be able to progress. But... Let me see here. Please don't get up. Okay, good. As long as he doesn't get up, I think I should be all right. But uh, again, we're going to be coming back to this as much as I possibly have the time to. Because I, what I really enjoy about this is just getting that experience. Like, especially for Halloween, I'm telling you all right now. I'm not a fan of the live action stuff because I think it's, it's terrible. But the animated films... I, especially during watching them like during the season of Halloween it's so much fun okay oh god what I'm gonna do now just in case is I'm gonna go on ahead and save my game because once I end up saving my game I think the first thing that I'm gonna do is try to go into some of the areas that I'm not supposed to and so let me go on ahead and save this just in case. Okay, so now that I've saved, I want to see if there are other areas that I can kind of go to right now. Because I, I believe, I think I know what I need to do. I need to obviously go and, Jesus, the lightning. I need to go and adjust those, uh, the lighting for one of those like mirrors or like those murals. Like there are these paintings that I need to go to for a specific room. And I think once I go over there, I'm going to go in ahead and sort that out if I can remember the colors. And then from that point, I should be able to access one of the courtyard sections to where I can grab one of the death masks and then make my way towards progressing further right now. Because, yeah, I thought these were, uh, I thought these were herbs that I can collect. Damn it. This game is so creepy. But, I don't know, I mean, towards the end, I don't know if you guys want to agree with me or not, but towards the end of this game... From what I can remember, you know, once you discover everything involving Barry and Wesker, it just becomes more of like a, like an action-y kind of, you know, game in a way-ish. Any crimson heads here? Oh, God. Oh. Anyone here? Anyone here? Anyone? Oh, yeah, I knew it. I knew it. Nah. Nah. You, you think I'm stupid? You think I don't know you're alive? No, God! Oh, God, hold on. Okay. Juked him. He, yo, he, what the? Oh, my God. I'm wasting bullets here, dude. I. Okay, is he dead? Okay, I know the other one's alive, too. What, you think I'm stupid, man? Oh, I know he's alive. Watch this. Get him, motherfucker! Oh, there he is. I knew it. I knew it. Nah. Is he dead? Back up. Is he, is he dead? Yeah, nah, I'm not trying to... I'm not trying to deal with these crimson heads, man. I just want to go in ahead and take a look at a few more things here because... Yeah, it's locked. Yeah, I, damn it, that damn helmet key, man. I know in order for me to get it, I need to go somehow be able to access the residence area so I can grab that freaking red book. And then just venture on over from there, but... We're definitely going to come back. Let me just... I hope this guy doesn't end up getting up here because that'll be a travesty. But either way, I hope you guys enjoyed because we're definitely not done with Resident Evil 1. We're, we're going to be coming back to this and uh, kind of exploring further, but I want to see what I got going on in here. Oh, yeah, there's the musical score. I knew it. Thank you all for watching, everybody, and I'll be seeing you all in the next one. Take it easy, everybody, and happy Halloween. Peace! The gap between us is getting smaller and smaller. Let's see how you handle Ultra Instinct. <laughs> Nothing you do can hurt me. I'm ready to test out this new power of mine. No Patara needed here.
You're looking at pure natural power. I'll make sure your death is slow and painful.